yeah. you know so normally he, right he, yeah <laughs> I mean normally you know again they're five eight five nine he's five ten and a half so he's lanky and I, and I gotta tell you additionally he's able to slip those jabs from Fox on the way in so he's able to move in. and he closes the gap he, he basically getting a professional and come back oh. Oh, big shot from Michael Fox and Maestre down on the canvas for the first time as a pro. That was that counter left hand off the slip. Keep on his toes. Use that stick with a better jab. It'd be very difficult to get in. Nice combination from Fox. Maestre getting in, but Maestre able to go to the body. It's a, it's a classic southpaw move. And then he switched up and went to the right uppercut. I, I... Were you watching Back to the Future last night, Joe? <laughs> Listen. It's okay. Good body work there by Maestre. Throwing, but now good head movement by Fox. On the liver. Usually when it's a right-hander, it's not the strong hand. It's a, it's a weaker hand. You're right, Joe. If, you, if you, we just walked into the arena, we didn't know who that was. We were watching this guy. Yeah. Looks like a guy with 30. And let me hit you? <laughs> you know. Right. Fight uh, like a man. Throw me a fastball. Enough of this curveball yeah, stuff. Yeah, right, but. right. <laughs> now, now, when Michael Fox was bent over there in that little clinch, uh, Maestre came over and hit him behind the back in the kidney. It was a... It was I a, said, uh, basically, I'm in camp training for six guys, and I don't even know if I'll have a fight. Hold out. Went on the move again. Blocked a couple punches right there. Made a side step and counter with the left hand and spun out again. <laughs> uh, we get into round number eight oh, here again. Oh, Fox beautiful. And Gabriel Maestre and Fox, and Maestre shakes it off, says no. But Fox, again, with that one knockdown, and able to keep land Maestre, dictate the pace and the range. And then lands See. the harder shots. My straight landed a shot, but then he eats one as well and backs up. Fox looks like he's taking control. Absolutely, and the best that that Maestre can really muster are some really good body shots. Throwing hard punches from the outside, and you see him getting countered right there by Fox again. They get locked up. Scorecard up there, and you see it wide in favor of Michael Fox every round after the first round. Good right hand there, and another right hand by Maestre, but he's in the final seconds now. He's going to need uh, a real prayer to land. He is now the interim WBA World Welterweight title holder and still undefeated Gabriel oh. El Capitan I mean, Maestre. How, how, how is that possible? Now, I, I, I don't, I try not to get upset by these things, but how is that even, I, Joe Goose said, I'm stunned it was 114-113, and I thought that has to be in favor of Fox. How could it even be that close?